My name's Steve Bailey. I'm the chair of the bass department at Berklee College of Music in Boston. I started playing when I was 12, went to college, and then I, uh, I ended up playing with a bunch of different people. Paquito de Rivera, Dizzy Gillespie, Jethro Tull, Willie Nelson, and Victor Wooten. My name is Victor Wooten. I'm a musician, with my main instrument being the bass. When I was born, my brothers were already playing music, and they needed a, a bass player. And so that was me right away. So I've, I've done this my whole life, and I enjoy it. And I'm happy now to get to share my experiences uh, with students at Berkeley. For me, the bass is more than an instrument. The bass is a role that music needs. For music to be complete, it needs something high, right? like the melody. It needs something in the middle, like the harmony and the chords. But it also needs the foundation, which is the bass. In more contemporary music, I think the bass is kind of the glue between harmony and melody and rhythm. Bass is a role that helps music be complete. I think women are, are increasingly uh, growing in music. Berkeley and Boston, we have more women bass players in the department now than ever. Younger students have role models. They have Rhonda Smith, Speranza, Tal Wilkenfeld, Antonella Mazza, and many other kind of mentors that, that have just come on the scene in the last 10, 10 or so years. But I'll still say it's underrepresented. We can support women in many ways, and I do see it happening more and more, gradually, slowly. And I believe that we can all do a whole lot more through acceptance, through recognition. So I think if we can just give them more opportunities and, and treat women for the special people that they are. And not to feel threatened, but females in every situation bring completeness. To be good at anything, or to be great at anything, takes work and it takes discipline. Bassists should learn the role of the instrument first. Our whole instrument was designed to support other people. A lot of younger people coming up pay attention to the flashy part, the solo, the techniques. And in many cases, they learn that first, but haven't learned to support someone. That's one uh, thing that I can see maybe being a problem. There are a lot of great bass players who aren't working. So what's gonna make the difference is what kind of person you are, how you interact with people, how you are in a band situation when you're on a tour bus and people get gigs and they don't keep gigs, not because of how they play, but of the kind of person they are. Most of us teachers teach you how to sound good, but we should be teaching you how to make someone else sound good. If you look on the main records, you'll see just a few bass players, and it's because they know these skills of how to support musicians, not just how to solo. Come here. Berkeley's an inspiring place. The energy is so high. Young people wanting everything that we've enjoyed in our careers, and, it, and it's invigorating. For me, one of the coolest things about Berkeley is that, you know, of course, it's the largest music school in the world and you're surrounded by thousands of other people with the same energy. Young, ready to grow, ready to receive. The bass has played a big role in my, it's brought me everything in my life. That's my inspiration. In helping myself, I should be making the world better. And music has that potential. We wanna make music and we want you to want to hear it. Uh -huh.